I'm going to give you a trick question that I bet you've never heard for the USMLE. So you're all going to think it's one diagnosis and then it's not going to be. So see if you can figure out the alternative diagnosis. Patient comes in, they have catecholamines in their urine, they have increased heart rate and increased blood pressure. The patient has anxiety, they have a feeling of insomnia. What's your diagnosis? Well, a lot of people are going to think that it's a pheochromocytoma, but what if I told you that they scanned the patient's chest, abdomen, and pelvis with a CT scan, and they did a nuclear medicine scan, and it showed no sign or source of a pheochromocytoma? Well, what's your diagnosis now? Your diagnosis is actually chronic mercury toxicity. So mercury can inhibit calm T, which can allow you to have a catecholamine overload, and it can even be spilled into your urine as well as your serum. And so these patients present almost identically to a pheochromocytoma, but they also generally have a desquamating rash on their palms and their feet. And so these patients can trick you. You can think it's a pheo, but it's